Hello my dear students today i will discuss few questions and answers from this chapter 1 the topic is computer hardware components the next slide contains chapter 1 exercise question number a give the full forms of the following number 1 pcb stands for printed circuit board number 2 alu stands for arithmetic logic unit number 3 cu stands for control unit number 4 mmu stands for main memory unit number 5 rom stands for read only memory number 6 ram stands for random access memory number 7 cpu stands for central processing unit number 8 modem stands for modulator demodulator number 9 www stands for world wide web number 10 VDU stands for visual display unit number 11 LCD stands for liquid crystal display number 12 LED stands for light emitting diode the next slide contains the next part of questions and answers number 13 DVD stands for digital video disc number 14 DPI stands for dots per inch number 15 USB stands for universal serial bus number 16 BD stands for blu ray disc number 17 SMPS stands for switched mode power supply question number b answer the following write the differences between the following question number a ram and rom the differences between ram and rom are as follows ram is a temporary storage rom is a permanent storage RAM stores data in MBs. ROM stores data in GBs. RAM is volatile. ROM is non-volatile. RAM is used in normal operation, but ROM is used in startup process of computer. In RAM, writing data is faster. but in rom writing data is slower the next slide contains the next part of questions and answers question number b hardware and software answer the differences between hardware and software are as follows hardware number 1 hardware is physical parts of computer that cause processing of data but software is set of instructions that tells a computer exactly what to do number 2 hardware cannot perform any task without software but software cannot be executed without hardware number 3 hardware can be seen and touched but software cannot be touched number 4 hardware is repaired in case of problem but software is debugged in case of problem the next slide contains next part of questions and answers question number c impact and non impact printers answer 
the differences between impact and non-impact printer are as follows impact printers these printers transfer the image onto the paper by physically striking a head or a needle against an ink ribbon to make mark on the paper but non impact printers work without making any touch between the print head and the surface on which it prints number 2 impact printers are slow noisy and inexpensive but non impact printers are faster noiseless and expensive number 3 the printing quality of impact printer is poor example dot matrix printer but the printing quality of non impact printer is much superior example laser printer the next slide contains the next part of questions and answers question number d touch screen and touch pad answer the differences between touch screen and touch pad are as follows touch screen a touch screen is a flat surface with a sensitive panel directly on that screen it is specially designed touch sensitive screen that responds to the touch of the users touch pad a touch pad is a flat control surface used to move the cursor and perform other functions on a computer question number c name the device number 1 pointing device that looks like a pen and is sensitive to light answer light pen the next slide contains the next part of this questions question number 2 it is used for video conferencing so that people can see each other answer webcam question number 3 it works by sensing the user's finger movement answer touch pad question number 4 it decodes a pattern of printed bars on various products in the market answer barcode reader question number d fill in the blanks question number 1 the hard disk and ram are the examples of dash hardware of the computer answer internal question number 2 external hardware can be categorized into dash dash and dash device answer input output and removable storage device question number 3 dash printers are faster and better than dash printer answer non impact printers are faster and better than impact printers the next slide contains few more fill in the blanks question number 4 when the cpu of a computer is on on a single chip of silicon it is called a dash answer microprocessor question number 5 a cd can hold around 700 mb of data while a dvd can store data of dash capacity 4.7 gb capacity question number 6 the dash unit of the cpu sends command signals to the other components of computer system 
आंसर सी ई यू सी यू स्टैंड फॉर कंट्रोल यूनिट क्वेश्चन नंबर सेवन क्वार्टी की बोर्ड्स हैव डैश कीज आंसर हंड्रेड फोर कीज क्वेश्चन नंबर एट स्लॉट्स ऑन द मदर बोर्ड यूज टू कनेक्ट पेरीफेरल्स और एक्सटर्नल डिवाइसेस आर कॉल्ड पोर्ट्स द नेक्स्ट स्लाइड कंटेंस द नेक्स्ट पार्ट ऑफ क्वेश्चन एंड आंसर्स क्वेश्चन नंबर ई नेम टू टाइप्स ऑफ ईच ऑफ द फॉलोइंग डिवाइसेस आंसर क्वेश्चन नंबर ए माउस ऑप्टिकल एंड कॉर्डलेस नंबर बी प्रिंटर्स इंकजेट प्रिंटर एंड लेजर पेंटर नंबर सी मूवेबल स्टोरेज डिवाइस पेन ड्राइव एंड एक्सटर्नल हार्ड डिस्क क्वेश्चन नंबर डी डिस्क ड्राइव हार्ड डिस्क ड्राइव एंड सी डी और डी वी डी ड्राइव क्वेश्चन नंबर ई सी डीज सी डी रॉम एंड सी डी आर डब्ल्यू द नेक्स्ट स्लाइड कंटेंस द नेक्स्ट पार्ट ऑफ क्वेश्चन एंड आंसर्स क्वेश्चन नंबर एफ एक्सप्लेन द फॉलोइंग टर्म्स नंबर वन प्लॉटर्स प्लॉटर्स आर यूज टू प्रिंटिंग हाई क्वालिटी ग्राफिक्स ऑन पेपर इट इज यूजफुल इन जेनरेटिंग ग्राफ्स चार्ट्स एंड डायग्राम्स इट इज एन आउटपुट डिवाइस नंबर टू वेब कैम A webcam is a camera that feeds its images in real time to a computer or a computer network often via universal serial bus in short USB or Wi-Fi webcams are embedded into display while they are connected to the USB port on the desktop computer it is widely used for video conferences number 3 scanner it is an input device it is used for the direct entry of data from source document into the computer it scans the document into a digital form so that it can be easily put into the computer the next slide contains the next part of questions and answers number 4 blu ray disc blu ray disc is also known as blu ray it is high quality optical disc that is used for recording rewriting and playing back high definition video the disc has a storage capacity of up to 25 gb on a single layer disc and 50 gb on a dual layer disc number 5 modem modem is a device that converts digital signal to analog signal at the time of transmitting and converts analog signals to digital signal at the time of receiving number 6 ports ports are slots on the motherboard into which a cable of external device is plugged in such as the mouse keyboard monitor microphone and speaker etc to the computer the next slide contains some questions and answers question number g answer the following questions question number a what is the role of cpu in the computer system answer the central processing unit is also known as the brain of the computer 
because its main function is to process the instructions. It controls the working of the entire computer system. It is placed on the motherboard inside the CPU box. The CPU has three major parts such as number one control unit in short CU number two arithmetic logic unit in short ALU number three main memory unit in short MMU question number B why is the motherboard called the backbone of the computer answer the main printed circuit board PCB found in the microcomputer is known as motherboard. It connects the CPU to the input and the output devices of the computer. It also connects hard drives, CD, DVD drives, RAM sticks, USB port, a power supply, etc. For this reason, the motherboard is the backbone of the computer. The next slide contains few more questions and answers. Question number C. Why pen drives are called flash drive? Answer. Pen drive is a portable data storage device. It is mainly used for transferring data as they are light and small. There is a small chip called flash drive to store data and has a USB universal serial bus connector for data transfer. For this reason, pen drives are called as flash drive. Question number D. What is barcode reader and ALU? Barcode reader. A barcode reader is an optical scanner that can read printed barcodes and send the data to a computer. Next is arithmetic logic unit, in short ALU. The ALU performs all the arithmetic and logical instructions. It consists of a number of registers. These registers are of very small capacity and contain data instructions which are to be executed. Students, in this session I have discussed some questions and answers from this chapter 1. That's all for now. Thank you.